I've glued my old selfie stick bracket thingy together with super glue because apart from that little broken thing the cheap one was way better than the, the, the slightly more expensive but not really expensive one so we're off for a walk and since it's a work day and there's a lot, a lot happening on a work day I thought I'd take you with us Yes, well, having it in on a uh, zoomed in mode makes you see all the dust on the mirror. <laughs> Lunch is packed. I'll make sure I don't have mascara on there. Lunch is packed. Uh, um, yeah, I just need to grab my bags, go and feed the chooks, and leave. Oh, I need to, I was going to pack some breakfast into a jar because I ran out of time. So I'll do that now and I'll see you a bit later. Good afternoon, guys. <laughs> you see me sitting here at my desk. And I was just looking through uh, some books that I've purchased and 
I've started flicking through this one here, the book that wouldn't burn. It's so good. I, some, I generally, when I buy a book, I'll just have a flick through it and get an idea. Um, I've got this one here as well. Um, this one here, I've read the first one. But I read it quite a few years ago and I have it here in the library and I thought, hmm, I didn't realise there was a sequel. At the time that I read it, there wasn't a sequel and I loved it. So I need to read the first one as well. And this one here. So a couple of these I actually had bought the second ones accidentally without realising that they were, they were part of a series. So I just got these ones to fill it up so that's good so I might take this book home with me to read before bed it's gripped me and that's the main thing uh, tonight we're going to have chicken parmigiana And I'm going to go through my soap making supplies. I just want to check to see what I've got quantity wise because I want to make, I usually make gifts for some family and friends um, at Christmas time. And last year I made soap, gardener's hand soap, and it was really nice. Um, but I thought about making dish soap so solid dish soap because I thought it'd be quite cool to see how that works and perhaps um, I just need to find I'll use that as a bookmark um, perhaps using let's see let's see a picture on here oh, yep so this person here has got a recipe and I thought it'd be quite cool to get a um to go op shopping and get some cute little dishes and then buy some of these brushes make soap and it can be little Christmas parcels that would be nice so I've got the recipe here but I need to just check which um, which ingredients I've got most of the ingredients but what, what quantities I need and there's some essential oils that I'll need and but so yeah because it usually takes about six weeks for soap cold press soap to um cold process soap to cure so if I do it now that'll bring me to the beginning of December which would be good it's a bit of a buffer um Yes, what else do I have to do when I get home? Vacuum, I need a vacuum. I actually need to get the spot cleaner out and do the carpet that's between the coffee table and the couch. It's got some marks on it, but we'll see how I feel. I don't know if I can be bothered. It's probably better to do it in the morning before we go to work so that it dries with no traffic over it. Yeah, so I'll just sit here waffling to you for a few minutes and it'll be time to go home. That time up there is incorrect because I have not changed it for daylight savings. So it's currently 10 past three. Mm. Yeah, I think that's about it. I'm just talking for the sake of talking now. <laughs> Carry on, sorry. See ya. Oh, hello. Who's that, Dick? Is that you? Are you ready to go? Hello. Good afternoon. I did record a little bit. I am um, <laughs> I'm in my pajamas and my dressing gown because it's really cold and windy outside, and I just felt like being wearing nice, loose, comfy, soft clothes. Um, 
I had a package waiting for me, and um, basically what it is 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 a starter kit for Norwex because I've signed back back up as a Norwex consultant, and I'd filmed unboxing it, and then I thought, oh, that might look like paid promotion, so I won't show you that. <laughs> uh, if you want to know about more about Norwex, just look it up, or you could look up my old. It's still open. I had never closed it down, but my old uh, independent Norwex console consultant page on Facebook under my name. Um, <laughs> I've got some fairly dodgy looking videos on how to use the products. And even though those videos were done in 2019, I look a lot younger because shit's happened since then. <laughs> Um, yeah, if you'd like to know more about that, but that's not what this channel's about. So I opened that and I've just started prepping dinner. We're going to have chicken parmigiana and I've vacuumed, yeah, emptied the rubbish bag, the rubbish bin. It's still messy, but it's not too bad. Um, so I've just made the tomato sauce and I've coated the chicken. So I'll grill the chicken a little bit later. I've just got some little new potatoes and I've put a little bit of spray oil, sprayed a bit of oil on them and I've put them in the oven to bake. So when they're close to being done, I will grill the chicken and, and then chuck the rest of that in the oven to cook. So... Yeah. Tell you what, I really, really want to cast on that rad vent, but I'm nearly done with the t-shirt, so I need to just knuckle down and do that. Ah. Okay. You'll see me soon. Ah. <sighs> Oh, oh, this is what I got up to last night anyway, with me spinning. So yeah, and I'm watching Mad Madam Mouse Knitting. She's really nice. Bye. And here is dinner. Oven baked potatoes, chicken parmigiana. something random on YouTube I will say good night to you guys now because I might not film anymore and there's a good chance I won't and I keep forgetting to say goodbye Sue I will catch you a little bit later or maybe tomorrow Bye.